Hey everyone, welcome to another Raid Shadow Legends video. Uh, today we're looking at the uh, Legendary Fusion. It's two days in, three days I think, this is the third day. Uh, where are you guys at? Are you doing the Fusion? Are you trying to get the Legendary Dwarf? That's what I'm doing. I'm almost there actually. Uh, I've farmed really hard this few past few days because I want to do it as fast as possible because I have the three days of XP boost that I got from my alt that I've been leveling up and then I had the one day extra from the uh, weekly uh, free boost and um, I had actually four days of 100 XP it's gonna finish up tomorrow in 21 hours so in three days guys let's look what i did i did in three days so in three days i finished the champion chase event without using any of my big shards so i just used mystery shards and the fusions the fusions give you 250 points in the champion chase event and then when you get the epic champion right here at 1500 points you get another 250 points so if you do two fusions and get the epic right here that's 750 points so uh, you can do it really easy this this event is really easy if you've been playing and using your gems to farm up uh six stars since the last video guys i've also leveled up to 60 i got a, a bit of a gem boost i got the maximum energy right here some free energy i had a pack which was ridiculously overpriced it was for 30 euros or something i didn't buy it of course and then um what else did i do since then i also leveled up seeker look at seeker i have him at six stars now fully ascended i put on put on him this beautiful banner plus 15 speed i got him to 269 speed so he's really good for arena right now uh what else did i do I also farmed up a lot of food guys uh, i took him to 60 i took seekers to 60 and then i farmed up, farmed up another five food five five stars right here guys and then i got the two epics that you have to uh, fuse up for the fusion i took them to 50 and fully ascended them because i ha already had all those rares uh, i leveled those up ascended them and then look at this look at the fusion look at where i'm at um I have these two, I'm 50% in, I'm almost fully uh, finished this tournament right here, the, the one that you need to level up champions in the tavern, and then I only need these two, Hill Nomad and Ragemonger from the Artifact leveling event, let's hope that's not a really hard one, because uh, I have farmed 16 million silver in this event, and let's hope that Plarium does not put a requirement for like 30 million silver, because I'm obviously going to fail with that. Look at the champion training tournament. I'm almost at 10,000 points. I farmed all these. I'm at 9,518 points. I just need 500 points. It's going to be easy in the next 11 days. We still have 11 days for the event, guys. And look at all my gems. Look at all my poor, poor gems. I had 2,150 gems when I started the event with you guys. The video that I did a few days ago. Now I have 750 gems. That's awful. That's awful considering where I'm at in the champion training event. I'm halfway there. I need to do it all over again. I don't have the gems. Uh, I really hope I can get at least the, the legendary skill tone, but it's going to be awful if I reach right here and don't get the sacred shard. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I still need 14,000 points. Okay, I have uh, 11 days, so 1,000 points a day. Does not sound that bad when I think of it right now, but um, it should be okay, guys. It should be okay. We also have the arena event going on right now. I used up a few of the arena refreshes I had saved up, and look at look at me. I'm uh, I'm halfway there. I don't need uh, Mar Marquez. I have him. I had him, and I fused him. But uh, I like the XP boost. They're giving us XP boost, guys, because of the tavern training event, the, the new event that they did. So don't get angry about that. Of course, they could have done a bit more, but at least they're giving us some brews and some chickens. Um, so that's okay. There's a dragon tournament going on, which I think is stupid. So we're back. The game crashed. I don't know why. So they, we have a dragon tournament right now. I don't know who's going to do it. Some people are going to do it because of the rewards, but... I'm just gonna do maybe 100 points after my XP boost is over, so I can get the 20 brews. Just, just there. And I'm not gonna spend any more energy when I need to go for that sacred shard. That sacred shard is why I did all this. Why I spent 1,100 gems, and of course the fusion. But it, you know, it's both of them. It's the sacred shard and the fusion. I also got one more sacred shard, guys, because I reached level 60. So 
that's a good thing we're gonna have an opening soon uh when the event is gonna come i used up i think i i used at least 800 mystery shards in three days because i've been farming 12-3 all day long uh i just use soros i go to 12-3 Soros can farm it in 10 seconds. That's my best time so far because I don't have him fully geared up. He needs a few more pieces right now. He's not at 100% XP, 100% uh, crit. He's not at 200 crit damage. So I still need to gear him up a bit, but he does his job. He's much better than Aethel in farming 12-3. Uh, as you see, it's nine seconds right here. It's going to take him about 20, I think now to finish up uh, 14. It went much better than expected. So I do this, I farm up my food. A good tip guys, if you wanna level up your characters and get the tournament points, go to the tavern. Before you level up fully, uh, before you, you have your food at maximum level, right? So you wanna rank them up. You need to level up your food as well, the, the food for your uh, max, max level food. So um, I do this for rank three and up. I don't do it for uh, rank twos. For rank twos, I just I just do this and finish up because uh, I think it's a waste to to use up your um, your bruise on those. But um, I actually used my bro my bruise, bruise when I level up these five guys to uh, fifty. You see them at level eighteen. That's because of three bruise. Three bruise takes them to level eighteen, and you get one hundred points for that. So. I got uh, 500 points for taking the rank 4 to rank 5 and another 500 points just because I took them to uh, level 18 with the bruise. So that's 1000 points. That was easy 1000 points. I mean, I could have taken them to 12-3 and leveled them to 18, but no, the bruise are much, much uh, more worth it for, um, for this event. And you still get the points for the champion training event. So guys. How's the tournament going for you? How's the uh, legendary fusion? Are you going for it? Are you not bothering at all? Uh, give me your comments down below. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.